I just got back. I was out because I needed to get some clothes for hip hop class. So I went to a mall and on my way back, I was like, I'll walk a little bit just to see if I can get to a better location for a taxi to pick me up. And there was like a protest or some sort of thing going on. It's probably political. And so I just decided to walk home and um, the one thing that I, I was like thinking about, I was like, I'll walk home. Hopefully I can find a store that will sell a lint roller. And I went everywhere and I can't find a place where they sell a lint roller. It's impossible. I went to a pet store. I went to many stores that it seems they should sell a lint roller, but they don't. I was really surprised the pet store didn't have one actually. So I did not find my lint roller, but my leggings are pretty much unwearable right now because there's so much lint on them. Leave down in the comments, where do you get lint roller? And also, if you speak Georgian, maybe you could tell me what that guy was saying. Clearly there's some sort of leader speaking in a microphone. I don't know what they, what they were saying. So if you know what they were saying, leave it down in the comments. <laughs> Driving in a line, huh? People are just honking randomly. I don't know if you can even hear that. I don't know. Just another day in Tbilisi. We got the apartment and they left uh, some wine for us too. But I'm very excited. So today is moving day. We've packed everything up. We still have to pack the board games. So I just finished the first delivery. It's just me because Kara is not feeling so good. So I'm basically bringing over two suitcases full of things in my backpack and then I unload everything and then I'm going to bring it all back and do it again and doing this in bolts. So this might take a couple hours, but I don't know what else we could do. It's looking so empty. Not much left, to be honest with you though. I think I'm gonna miss this place. We've kind of called it home for a little while now, almost two months. I'm gonna miss it, mostly for the location, I think. The location is great. What's next? Uh, I have to bring that bag. Last time. Yep, last trip.
We are here. Yes. Now I gotta go get sheets, like right now. Yeah, we don't have anything to sleep in tonight. So we're getting settled in, but I just wanted to put in a little snippet here, which is Dylan just drank out of this bowl because there aren't any cups. And I just think that's really funny. But as you can see, <laughs> we have a lot of uh, putting away to do. Probably mostly do that tomorrow. So one thing that kind of sucks is that the owners didn't seem to wash the place before we came here. You can see how the floor is a little bit dirty. It's all dirty from like the apartment being like constructed. We are the first people to live in this apartment. And when you build things and put grout in between the tiles and stuff, it causes a big mess, but unfortunately, I don't think they cleaned everything. I mean, this doesn't seem to come off. Mopping is now my job while Dylan goes out and gets some things for the apartment. <laughs> Guys, I know you guys were really excited if I ever found a lint roller and Dylan found one for me at the store today and I'm super excited about it. It looks so much better now. It is now official. We have moved in. We have glassware. Yes, we don't have spoons or knives, but we have glasses. <laughs> yeah, we went to, I just got back from the store and I was trying to buy like a silverware set and pots and pans and some stuff like that. And I got pretty much everything on the list except spoons. They only had forks and knives and some spoons with little like Mickey Mouses or a duck or something on them. So <laughs> I chose not to get the duck spoons. Oh my God. It turns out the mugs that we got are even better than we thought. They That's change so awesome. when you put the tea in they turn from stars to planets. Man, what a score. So, because we're both sick, instead of having a fun weekend this weekend, having a, a party, we're just stuck at home. We can't even leave the house to buy another blanket. So we're just, we're using this as a blanket and watching Naruto. We also don't have any food, so we have to order all our food. It's a rough life right now. <laughs> so we just, ordered some stuff from the steakhouse, but yeah. today the order was a little bit odd. So, first of all, we got some juices. There's like a really good, um, it's like broccoli, green apple, ginger, lemon. I know it kinda sounds weird. I'm kinda excited about it, but no. <laughs> Don't get a, a virgin pina colada. Yeah, from a steakhouse. Yeah, and then we ordered six knives. We need some steak knives, why not? And they just called because they're like, hey, uh, you want steak knives and smoothies? And we're like, yeah, yeah, that's right. And they're like, oh, um, okay, we'll get that to you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, some translations are particularly good. This one is particularly bad and everything is wrong, but it's also all hilarious. We've also got cubs of cattle beef fat. And there's probably more, but I'm only on like the first page. So, uh, what about this cheese is non-fictional? What you doing? Trying to order our Thanksgiving food. <laughs> yeah, we have to spend Thanksgiving alone because we're sick. Mm -hmm. 